Hi Seth, this is Miss Thompson with Pasco eSchool. I went ahead and created this little video for you. As you can see, I am logged in as you. Um, but this will help you get started in the course. I know you've been in the course for a little while and you're still having difficulty accessing lessons and submitting assignments. So uh, the other navigation video might not been a, have been as specific to you, so I wanted to do uh, one more. So here you can see this is where you access your lessons right here. Before you do that, please do the getting started section. And when you're going through there, please use the uh, right arrows to make sure you're not missing anything. So this is key. Before you jump in and try to get started again, please do that first. Um, after you do that, you're going to go ahead and get started on path one, the learner path. Um, you can go through and select everything by link this way all right so if you go to the learner path and go to the first um, the pretest which you have already completed so you're going to want to um, make sure that you look at this checklist as well as you're going through and this checklist will um, keep help you keep track of everything to make sure you're doing what you need to do as the paths progress and in each path so you can use that right arrow navigation again and that will ensure that you don't miss anything. All right, so you will go ahead and complete the pretest. And um, the next thing that you'll want to start doing is completing the assessments. Okay, so after you do that, you're going to start going through and completing the lessons. And as you go through the lessons, you're going to receive information necessary to complete the assessments. All right, so after you go through this lesson, you're going to get the lesson summary, um, and you'll have different resources, and then you're going to um, have an assessment. You can access the assessments over here. All right, so as you want to submit the assessments, you can click on them and then you can type something in like I really enjoyed this or if you don't need to, you don't have to type anything at all. But I know you were asking about how to upload files. So right here it's going to say add file. Any file on your computer will appear. You'll go ahead and select that and click open. Okay. And once you do so, you can hit submit for grading and then I will receive it on my end. Alright, so I hope this helps you. If you still have any questions, please let me know.